Welcome to the Tile News and SNEC Solar Leadership Conversations. My name is Michael Schmiller. I'm the Managing Director of Tile News and I'm very happy to have with us Charles Jung, Vice President of the Distributed Generation Business of Longji. Welcome, Charles. Thank you, Michael. Nice to meet you. Nice meeting you. So, um, let's talk a little bit about the DG business. So, um, Longji is only one of two companies that recently exceeded the 23% module efficiency limit. I think that was quite a one. We, we've been there for, yeah, I think, on the 22% level for a long, long time. So it was almost a quantum leap, we can say. And, and the, the, the reason is actually your new HIMO 6 modules, yeah. uh, which is based on, your, on a new cell technology. Can you provide some background on that? Okay. So, um, as you know, you know, recent years, there's uh, very uh, fierce and, uh, and also homogeneous competition in the solar market. So, Longji always think, uh, you know, our, we should focus on the technology innovation in order we get a competitive advantage rather than just the uh, pricing competition. Even most of the Chinese company <laughs> is good on that. However, we want to uh, really uh, focus on our, our technology innovation, which we demonstrate that a long time, you know, uh, you know, for last decades, you know. However, um, what technology we should look at? We explore many uh, kind of technology and also spend uh, lots of money on that. We we, we actually more than five percent, uh, you know, R&D investment uh, of sales revenue, which is uh, I think is number one in this industry. So, because we think, uh, you know, uh, the uh, cell, uh, the conversion efficiency of a cell and also reliability is key for this uh, industry because these products need used for 25 years. So, not only for, you know, conversion efficiency, but also the reliability is also very important. So, that's why after explore many different technology, we find uh, the, the, the HPPC technology is one of that which can match both conversion efficiency and also the reliability, but also aesthetics because in the distributed uh, you know, generation market, um, most of the users not only look at um, you know, the efficiency, but also safety is also important, which is using some of uh, residential market, CNI market, not the, you know, like, uh, you know, large scale in the, in, in the desert or some area, but this is really people staying, not only the residential, but also people working under CNI, you know, uh, in environment. So safety are also very crucial. Uh, so by looking at HPPC technology, we using the, you know, from side, um, you know, the, the, the bus bar free technology, which in, enhance our light absorption because we don't have that, uh, you know, bus, you know, that uh, you're going to tremendously increase our efficiency. But also because we're using that uh, certain, the, the, the changes from the Z shape wielding into the backside of one line shaping, which enhance our resistance to micro crack. So, so after, you know, our R&D fellows investigate a few technology, we think the HPPC, at least in this moment, is a perfect product for our distributor markets. Of course, there's a lots of day and night efforts on that, needless to say. But, uh, you know, that's what uh, Longji always focusing on, technology innovation. Okay. Can, can you... When, when we talk about HPBC technology, that's mm. of course a premium technology. Mm. It's um, it's probably also a little bit more costly than normal t standard technology. So mm. so what's um, what, what what's your capacity and what's uh, your roadmap for for that technology in terms of expansion? So what's mm -hmm. available today and. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, first of all, in terms of the uh, market needs, right? We always need um, you know prepare our capacity for the market needs first of all at uh, this time you know because of uh, our design of this uh, the, the the rationale behind these products because when we define our technology roadmap you always need to uh, think about what the customer needs you meet as, as i mentioned in the 
Uh, first is certainly is conversion efficiency. Secondly is the safety. Third is aesthetics. So which is perfectly matching with our distributed generation market. After we launch this product, you know, we also uh, define few series. So actually we receive, you know, very good feedback, uh, especially when we do the road uh, the launch in the European, uh, which customers really like it. We get a uh, uh, tremendous, uh, you know, demand for that. But as you see, for the uh, product launching, you always have the timeline. You need to, you know, you know, educate your customer and 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 helping our installer to, you know, to advocate to our end users. So you know, we we step by step to launch this product. So far, we prepared 24, uh, 25 gigawatt. Uh, the capacity, you know, we think uh, at uh, this time, this capacity is is good for this current demand because it's uh, certainly is is kind of um, a market, uh, you know, in, you you want to focus on, which is not the means, which is not the largely pop, you know, common market. It's certainly the market our product, you know, is tailored or customized for those customer needs. So we think uh, this twenty five gigawatt. Mm -hmm. So far, it's, it's good for our, you know, our demand. Okay, mm. and um, you already said that, uh, that there was a very positive um, response in Europe. So um, what, what are the major markets and, and wh where do you want to market the product? Okay, so there's a few, um, a, few, a few places. First of all, you know, certainly we think it's the um, residential area, you know, because for the residential, they really like the 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 uh, generate power for conversion efficiency, which is uh, our product right now is very good for that. Um, uh, and then secondly is for CNI unit, commercial and industry. They really look at uh, not only generate efficiency, generate power, but also the safety. Because uh, you know for safety purpose, you know you can imagine if your product is not the safe. Uh, that anything happen, it could impact the normal production. Mm -hmm. That the loss could be hu humendous, and, you know, rather than just uh, competing with the power generated. So that's why, from safety purpose, we also have the series, especially uh, you know, consider their safety and uh, and uh, intelligence inside. So these two area, we think is uh, exactly the, the, the purpose of uh, why we design these products. And the safety and um, um, so, 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 so what's different then that, uh, that improves also the safety? You already said the back contact, of course, uh, has, a, has an inherent uh, advantage. But um, mm. when you look at the whole module? Uh, for example, for some series like, um, uh, like uh, we call the uh, Guardian, uh -huh. uh, which is one of the series. We have four series. One is uh, you know explorer, scientist, and uh, a guardian, and uh, the last one is uh, artist. You know artist. Okay, this guardian is especially because we have uh, intelligent uh, you know component inside, which can detect what is the shadow and what is the you know electricity generation, and then consequently be intelligent to shut down certain you know you know you know you know you know uh, you know the the the. the to close that in order to protect our 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 customers, so that's something intelligent inside for guarding, uh, to to for the safety purpose. That's especially serious to design for that safety purpose. For example, like uh, the government, you know, the school, and uh, you know the the chemical factory. So this product is specially tailored for the people care about the safety at most. Okay. Okay. Mm. And um, and um, so and and in terms of markets also, mm. so that's applications. You named Europe. It's it's mostly the focus on Europe, or are you also um, selling the product in in other um, oh, regions? I, yeah. No. Certainly not only the the, the European market because, uh, you know, you can imagine for distributor generation market, uh, you always can find um, uh, lots of different needs. For example, in China. In US, in European, the customer have a different uh, requirement on that. Uh, for example, European, like a Nordic, they like the simplicity and the beauty, right? So if you provide some product in your residential, which is bus-free, even uh, even optimum, you know, uh, you know, black 
which is fantastic for you, right? But also, if you look at it in China, recently we also to combine this uh, you know, product with our building material. We build a BIPV in the future uh, also, which is building integrated uh, photovoltaic products. So you can combine this high efficient product with the building material to set up the, for, the, for, the, for the commercial and the industry CNI. So, and then, you know, for the, for, the, for, the, uh, for the US, you also can find the product like, like a high efficiency, really high efficient product, which we call the scientist. So which is much, uh, you know, it, not much, you know, it's a higher gen conversion efficiency for the, for, that, for, for the product for the certain, for the certain market. Of course, the price will be considerably higher, but if you look at the 25 years product life cycle, which is very worth. Uh, so in short, uh, you always can, you know, find uh, your series different for, that's why we developed four series. You always can find, uh, you know, one of the series can meet certain requirement from that market. But in my world, still not enough. So that's why, you know, we still need to continuously to invest, to work with our customer and the user in order we can provide more product to our end users. But, but you still think that high efficiency is key for distributed markets? Uh, yeah, I think uh, that's one of the um, most important why I say that. If you look at um, in the future, you know, large scale utility will be, have less and less space, right? Because, you know, even we have a huge amount of a desert, but you need the trans transition, of, a transition of this uh, electricity to the to the place to use the power. So that's why even in China, you can look at the last year, our distributed market uh, you know, is booming because you can absorb that at the same time. You know? So which means, however, distributed market, you only have a limited, very limited space in your roof. So how can you generate more power in the very limited place is extremely important, right? So that's why you know, high conversion efficiency always is one of the most critical part. part. Mm -hmm. uh, however, in my view, safety is also important. I, I wouldn't say, that's why I say high conversion efficiency is one of. Safety is also important. So how your module connect with your building, uh, like you have a safety method, and also you can uh, you know, link with your, uh, your module with uh, your building Similarly, like a BIPV we developed, is also important. Of course, for athletic, in my view, for some people may not that care about that, like a CNI <laughs> industry. But uh, for for the residential uh, or for some country, they may like it. So, in my view, uh, high conversion efficiency and also safety. Mm -hmm. You know, two parts are very important. Okay, maybe mm. I think you mentioned also that uh, that you already catered a lot of applications, but you would love to see much, much more. Exactly. So, so w w what can we expect? Uh, is, there, is there something you already have in mind, or is this what the market still has to define at some point? Uh, you know, of course, certainly we have our roadmap. Yeah. That's why in our organization we have... Uh, called the uh, Product Development and uh, Solution Center. Uh, and also, you know, for your information, we probably will, you know, develop that, uh, you know, have uh, those center in the, in the different country also, not only just in China. We also want to invest, for example, in European, this kind of center, certainly in the future, Latin America or even US, depends. So in order, because you can see those, uh, you know, needs, you have to explore and then, you know, exchange information. So, um, you know, you always, you know, in my view and also our, uh, you know, uh, leadership also mentioned in the future, you know, solo will be everywhere, not only in the desert, in the, in the you know, you know, desert, not only in the roof, but be maybe on the river, it's already happened, right? And also in our roadside, you always can find a, Lots of different scenario. So, so in my view, you know, you have to work with local country 
because that's you also limited by the policy of the certain country. They have a standard for electricity for the building. You have to cater for that. But finally, you always come in order. Solar should be everywhere. You have to, you know, understand that the needs on the developed product maybe only for that country. I, I tell you that could happen. You know, certain product for certain country. You know, certain product for certain area depends on the. The, the needs or, or, or standard or, or certain policy, you know. So I just told you that's on the way. Because it's also possible now that the volume is there because in the, in the past it was not possible. It would have been too expensive, right? Exactly. So right now you have a, you know, you, you have a scale, right? You have scale. And also not only scale. Another point I think is when people, you know, when you have the, uh, you know, very common product, some of the problem it already become commodity, right? So in order to cater for the you know differentiated need product, differentiate the needs, you need to develop those differentiated product to you know suit for different needs. Previously, maybe that needs just uh, be uh, you know be you know meet by common products, but actually they are not very happy. It's because you don't provide that differentiated product. So in my view. As this mark, as this industry growth, uh, you know, commercial efficiency always important. That's why, you know, Longji, I think it's already last uh, few years we fourteen times, you know, you know, break the historic record. We will continuously invest on that. But another side, we will continuously invest on how to meet requirement on the different market, because these two side will be the really difference of the of this company. Okay, that's great if the customer is uh, considered premium and first. So thank you so much, Charles. Thank you, thank you.